Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Cancer. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of August. This is being recorded in July. A lot of you will watch this in July. This reading is for August. Okay, so I still get people that comment below, you know, oh, this isn't me, or blah, blah, blah. It hasn't happened yet. Okay, even if you watch this in August, timing is fluid. It really is. Okay, could happen in September, could happen at any time. Again, this reading may not even be for you. So, let's just see what comes up for Cancer for the month of August. What do we have for August for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Wisdom, it could be dealing with a Taurus. Doesn't have to be, but this is a this is the Hierophant. So this is a direct connection to God. You could be dealing with somebody that has one, or you do. This is a high intuition. This is somebody in a position of authority. Really, really listens to their gut. Somebody that is very, very spiritual. This is a channeler. This is um, somebody that really, really believes in themselves, and they should. Okay, um, this is a teacher, a counselor, a counselor, a mentor, uh, a mentor, sorry, a spiritual teacher. This could be you, could be somebody that you're dealing with. Um, wisdom, this this is somebody that is, is very, very, very spiritual. So, it, you know, it feels like it could be you. Um, this could, they, they, you could be dealing with somebody that... Um, is very very intuitive or it's you I mean this is uh, this person is very very spiritual uh, has a direct connection to God there's an, you see this dog is even like this person is so this is very high vibrational okay this is a very, maybe it's you maybe you're vibrating on a very high level or you're dealing with somebody that um, vibrates on a very, very high level. Um, this is a higher power right here, having a lot of wisdom, um, internal wisdom as well, uh, whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with. Um, there's definitely a higher power that is guiding you this month. This is like a guiding light. Everybody can see, you know, as the dog can even see this, this person's, uh, energy. It's a very godly energy, spiritual energy. You could be dealing with a spiritual person, could be a spiritual teacher, could be, um, a guidance counselor, somebody that guides other people, could be a priest. Ooh, Interesting. Now, this could be, be a funeral. This the 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 hierophant is associated with the church. So, the, and this I just see casket here. So I don't know if you're going to be attending a funeral or going to a funeral or, I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm just being honest with you. Um, that fell out. Okay, someone going out of your life or the end of a situation. Okay. So don't be scared because endings lead to new beginnings, okay? And this doesn't have to be a person. It doesn't have to be. But um, it could be the end of a situation. So something is going on. God is involved, okay? There's a higher power involved here. And it doesn't, I mean, it can be a person. It says someone or a situation so someone or a situation something is going out of your life there is a and it's interesting that i've mentioned god before this even fell you saw it fall out um it's like something to do with the family i, I think it's a family member there's an end of a situation probably with a family member rat oh my god not good. Someone working against you behind your back. Wonderful. Not fire. Ooh. Strong emotion. Passionate love or hate. Ladder. Climbing towards success. 
So somebody is climbing the ladder towards success. Now this could be changing. There could be a change in the family hierarchy or patriarchy or whatever you want to call it. Legacy. All right. Um, which puts you in a lead position. Um, you, there, you are dealing with a rat though. There is a rat here. So you've got somebody here that is working against you. They're working behind your back. This person may be trying to climb the ladder. Okay. Maybe they hate you. Okay. Or they love you and they want some sort of revenge or whatever. I think that you need to be very careful this month. Okay. Um, because you got somebody here that doesn't like you and they may be, they may be you're climbing the ladder and they're jealous. Um, they, they, this is all stems from some sort of passion, passionate love or hate. Uh, you just definitely need to be careful this month. There's going to be, uh, something is going to happen. Someone is, is going out of your life or something is coming to an end. Okay. Remember, there's a higher power involved here. Um, JB may have to do with initials JB or BJ or something like that. Um, now this is your intuition and this is high intuition. Okay. The, the hair font is somebody that is in authority, a high place of authority that is, uh, making a call, I believe coming for a visit. Somebody, and this could be even the government. I'm not sure. Somebody may be coming for a visit and then that changes your circumstances. Um, now, now this is the high priestess is intuition, got a need to retreat, to listen to yourself, um, receiving messages. You're going to be receiving lots of messages this month as well. Intuitive messages. Um, you're probably going to need some time alone, uh, to reflect on whatever is happening. Okay. Definitely very, very spiritual energy here. Okay. Uh, your dreams may be talking to you this month. Okay, so pay attention to your dreams. Um, there's some sort of secrets. Somebody is keeping secrets from you. Okay. Oh, they're about to get caught. Somebody's about to get caught. There's spends there's 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 this is like robbery or stealing or Deception, secrets coming out, somebody is about to get caught. They are definitely about to get caught. They're not looking where they're going. They're they're being uh well, what's the word for it? They're not thinking clearly. They're, they're a petty mistake is gonna get them in trouble. Somebody is going to make a stupid mistake, put it that way. And this is like going, going alone, going alone. So somebody's going to be going alone. They're going to be going alone. Queen of Wands reverse. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. That this this person may be revengeful. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius could be revengeful towards you. Um, this person, uh, this could be like foul play or something. I don't know. This, this is, uh, uh, somebody that is very self-righteous, manipulative and controlling. This person is a liar. They are very ja um, jealous, very, very jealous, very nasty, very melodramatic, going to throw a fit. Somebody may throw a fit. They're, 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 this could be another woman. Maybe there's been some cheating. If the, if somebody has been cheating or, you know, this could be the other woman. This other woman is out for revenge. Okay. She's out for re revenge and, you know, it causes a big problem. Passionate, love, or hate. That's what this is. It's a fire sign. I do believe that it is a fire sign. I think you are dealing with a fire sign that, uh, uh, is not happy with you. This person is not happy with you. Um, it's passionate love or hate. And it's probably both. It went from love to hate. And now this person is revengeful. Um, there may have been some sort of, uh, sexual connection. I feel like that's what it was. 
and they're grieving and when you're grieving people act out of their grief um so uh yeah uh, this could be another woman okay or another person uh this is uh it's time to focus on the future. I feel like you have another opportunity here. You have a choice between two people and you got somebody that is very, very, very jealous. Um, this is focusing on the future. You're going to have to make a choice. Um, you're gonna need time to go within and think. Something is gonna happen. Something is gonna happen that um, I feel like you have somebody here that is very forceful. They're very forceful. They're, they they don't like to lose control. And I feel like they are going to, they may tell, they may rat on you. They may rat, somebody may be ratted out. I don't know what that means. Um, but that's what I feel. This person wants a reunion. They want a reunion. Um, they want to be with you and they're jealous. Um, and this could go vice versa. So I don't know. Um, this is an unexpected choice. There could be a reunion here. Okay. Cause this is a reunion. This is a re this could be a reunion. Somebody wants a reunion. Um, ah, yeah. Something, this is like wanting, it's not wanting it to end. Somebody doesn't want something to end and they're suffering. They're in a lot of pain. They're there. They're really, 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 really suffering. Um, this is like, they, they, they're, they're, uh, things getting worse. It's like there's some chronic health problems here and somebody is, is feeling really, really, really down, really, really, really down. And they don't, they don't want, they don't want to be the one that isn't chosen. Um, it's over, it ended and they're, they're very, very, very upset. So be prepared to deal with whoever this person is. Now this is not surviving, not surviving. Uh, uh, they may, there's, it's like there was some sort of, uh, sexual interaction and it not, didn't survive. Um, uh, this is going as low as you can go. So somebody may go as low as they can go at, at, as an act of revenge. Okay. So. I hate to give you that kind of message, but um, it is what it is. Uh, let's see what else we can get. You're probably going to need to retreat. I think that you're going to need time alone. Uh, something, this somebody, you know, this could be somebody uh, that you were had some sort of soulmate connection with. Maybe this is the person that is going out of your life. Okay, maybe this person is reuniting or are you going with somebody else? They're choosing somebody. They're choosing another woman. They're choosing another man. They're choosing somebody else. And that's the end. Okay, there is definitely a choice. Somebody is making a choice uh, to focus on the future. They are, they're ma whether it's you or, the, or whoever it is, they are making a choice to focus on the future. They are. There's no coming back. There's no coming back. The choice has been made. Um, hmm. Not very dissatisfied. Very unhappy. We have somebody here that has a, a big, big, big ego. And they, it feels like they're going to lose it all. If, I don't know who it is. It could be this person that is going out of your life could be you um that is like losing it all it's like very unhappy dissatisfied it's not what you were hoping for or they were hoping for there's definitely been lies there's been deception the truth is going to come out they've been able to hide the truth but the truth is going to become out this person is very arrogant and egotistical and they thought they had it all whoever this person is well they're about to fall flat on their face um, Ace of Swords. The truth is coming out. The truth. The whole truth. There's going to be some sort of a wake-up call. Somebody's going to get a wake-up call. Um, they get caught. They get caught by somebody that... Uh, well, somebody tattles. This is a rat. Somebody is, is saying something. They're tattling. They're causing problems. Um, you may have sensed that something, somebody was hiding something, that somebody was cheating or somebody was lying or something like that. If you sense that, then it's true. Okay, it's absolutely the truth. 
Okay, there's some sort of truth that is about to be revealed this month about, I think it's a sexual connection, okay? It's a, it is. I feel like it's a sexual connection. The truth comes out and it causes um, a lot of drama, okay? I definitely see some sort of drama. And, and this is like an ending. It is. It's, it is. It's a serious ending. Um, get prepared for an arrival of some sort. This person may show up. Um, I hope that you're getting prepared. Uh, this is like hoping for the best. Focusing on the future. Somebody is is going to be focusing on the future. They're going to be traveling, going someplace. Accepting the truth because they're not going to have a choice. They're not because the choice is being made by somebody else. The choice is being made to focus on the future. Somebody is is going to be focusing on the future, letting bygones be bygones, and not going back, not going back. And it's like the choice is made. You don't you don't have a choice anymore. Um, it's over. It is definitely over. It's a dramatic ending as well. I think it is very dramatic. It's like you, you definitely don't see it coming. It, this does allow you to focus on the future. It allows you to move forward. Um, some sort of truth is about to come out. And I think that you're kind of prepared for this. It feels like you've been getting prepared for this in some way. It's the end of this contract. This is the end of a contract. Focusing on the future, looking forward, not backwards. It feels like you've been waiting or somebody's been waiting. They've been waiting and waiting and now is the time. They've been waiting. Somebody's been waiting for uh, the option. They've been waiting to, for, to be chosen and it's time. It's time because the lovers is right here. You may have been waiting for somebody to come in. And this is a different part of the story. Somebody has been waiting for an arrival. Here it comes. There's an unexpected choice in love. So there is somebody coming in that is a perfect match for you. It is. But, but there is a separation here. Okay, because of this too, this five of cups, there's been, somebody has been focused on a loss. They've been focused on a loss for some time. They weren't focusing on a new opportunity, but now they are, they're ready. They're ready and they're ready because whoever they were dealing with, um, hurts them extremely bad. This is extremely painful extremely painful there's some sort of rep reveal or information that comes out that uh enlightens per se yeah that that really uh shows the truth you know it does it, it doesn't make you happy when you hear the information but it's the truth Okay, it's like you can't deny it. And your gut was probably telling you about this. Your gut was probably telling you that this person was cheating or deceiving or lying or stealing or whatever the hell they were doing. And now the truth, the truth comes out. The truth comes out by another person. There's another person that is vindictive and jealous and this person can't hold their tongue. Okay, they can't. It's very melodramatic and cannot just burst. This just, just, just burst the bubble. This person, you've been waiting for this person to to speak up well this person is about to speak up or whoever this third party is i do feel like it's a third party i feel like the third party speaks up and gives you the information that you need or it's the person that you're dealing with somebody speaks up and gives you the in somebody does they give some sort of information that uh helps you to focus on the future and let go of this dead end. Because this is definitely a dead end. We do have a new opportunity for love here as well. With the Two of Cups reverse and the Lovers. There's a, there's a choice between two lovers here. And somebody doesn't get chosen. And the person... Uh, or if it's not lovers, it's partners, okay? There's a choice between two. And somebody's going to get really angry and pissed off that they don't get chosen. 
and they flip. I feel like they flip out. I do. I feel like they flip out and, and it causes a, a, well, the death of a situation. Okay. Something ends and it ends badly. This is this is this is arriving in threes as well. We could have like three things showing up. So whatever that means, it's like you 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 may have been expecting only one. Well, three three show up. So there could be three options here. Anyway, I think that you need to get prepared for an arrival, arrival of three. You know, I I don't know what that means, but I feel like you need to get prepared for an arrival of three. Um, Somebody is about to get an awakening. They're about to get a wake-up call. There could be a departure as well. This could be a departure. Somebody may be departing. They're headed towards a new lover. They're headed towards a new partner. They're headed towards a soulmate. They may be getting on board with a new soulmate. There's been some sort of procrastination. There's been a lack of confidence. There's been a lack of uh, self-esteem. But this is focusing on the future now. Um, so just saying somebody may be making the decision because this is a choice to focus. Definitely focus on the future. Focusing on the future is huge here. After this ends, there's going to be an ending here. Somebody is going out of your life, but this leads to a new beginning. It does because a lover is a, is an unexpected choice in love. Somebody may be choosing somebody all of a sudden. They're choosing somebody else and, you know, that that that, that hurts, okay? That is definitely painful. Um This is accepting the truth, seeing the truth, seeing a new lover. There is a new lover here. There is a new lover. You may be communicating with somebody new this month. This may have uh there may this they, they may it may have nearly ended. Maybe it was a it nearly ended, but now communication starts back up, something like that. Um oh, hermit reversed. This is time to reconnect. To come out of hiding, to come out of loneliness. It's the end of loneliness. It's time to, you know, take a new approach. Maybe somebody's been lying to themselves. They've been deceiving themselves. Not seeing the light. Remember I mentioned enlightenment earlier. They were refusing to see the light, but this is seeing the light. So this is seeing the light. This is like a midlife crisis as well. And this is a rejection. So somebody, there's a, there's a rejection here. Somebody is being rejected. They've been able to hide. They've been hiding the truth. They've been hiding the truth. But the truth is about to be revealed. The light is about to be shed on some sort of deception or cheating or whatever the hell it is. You are definitely, and you've probably been sensing this. You've been sensing something was going to happen. And I think that whatever you've been sensing probably is the truth. Okay. Get prepared to, get prepared to hear some communication. Okay. That probably doesn't make you happy. Okay. Somebody could, people could be rolling in and I don't know what that means. I don't know what I, what I, what I saw when I said that earlier was like police cars. <laughs> So I don't know. I felt like three police cars or whatever you want to call it. It's like, I don't know if it's police or, uh, well, it could be anything, you know, along the line of police cars, emergency vehicles. You know, I don't know what it is coming in. We definitely have an individual here that is not happy and, uh, they're very, very, um, upset they're upset that they weren't chosen so i'm not sure what that means for you um jealous very 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 jealous um one more card Ooh, 
four of pentacles reversed. Now that is opening up. This person is about to open up. They are about to open up. They're, they're done holding it in. They aren't going to hold it in anymore. Somebody's going to explode. Whoever this person is that ha feels cheated, they feel betrayed. Somebody feels betrayed, whether it's you or whoever it is. There's, there's somebody here that feels betrayed. They're about to open up. They're about to. They're about to not, not hide anything anymore. They're. 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 They're not. They're not going to hide whatever it is that they're hiding. They're going to tell. They're going to tell. They are definitely going to tell, and they're not. And they, there's no stopping this person. Um, they're very, very unhappy um, with whatever has happened. Ooh, I'm not sure. You could be dealing with a Leo. You could be dealing with a Leo. I think it's a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Could be Leo in particular. Um, this person, they can't restrain themselves. They can't master their emotions. Uh, they're not going to be very calm. It's not whoever this person is. This person is, uh, uh, I feel like they're going to flip right out. That's what I see. I, th I feel like it's a flip out session and somebody, you know, the cops get called or the ambulance or, uh, you know, whatever you want to consider emergency okay um whatever it is uh, this isn't going to make you happy it's not going to make you happy um good luck cancer i mean i can't i can't make it pretty if it's not pretty and this does not appear to be pretty i feel like august is going to be a month where you are dealing with somebody that um well, it's passionate love and hate, put it that way. And they are going to be expressing their strong emotion. Good luck. <laughs>